Okay, in this, in this problem we're going to identify percentile values given um, some data point that they want. So here's the data and we want to identify the percentile of 0.7. So if we look through here, 0.7, there's a couple of few 0.7s. Keep in mind that percentiles are measures of, a lo of location and so they're denoted usually by p sub 1, p sub 2, p sub 30. Uh, for their percentile, um, which divide a set of data into a hundred groups with about one percent of the values in each group. So that's what it does. So we want to find where does the percent, what's the percentile of 0.7? What is lat land? That says the 20th percentile. Well, open this up in StatCrunch. Let's sort our data so we can see that and how you do it. This is already sorted, but you can go in here and sort table from ascending. And then we find 0.7. It says percentile of 0.7, so I go to 0.7, and I actually take the one before it. So I see how many rows there are, and since it counts exactly up on my rows here, it's 10 over the total, and there's 50. So we go ahead and take 10 divided by 50, and that gives us our percentile. So 0.2 is the 20th percentile, and that's why it's 20, because we have a percentile. Now if you wanted to know what what percentile is, um, let's say, the 30th percentile, maybe I want to find the 30th percentile. It's a little different, right? It's asking the 30th percentile. Well then we go to stat, calculators, or sorry, stat, summary stats, columns, choose our data. Then we come down here and look at, we just can find the percentile. It can just find it for us. So 30th percentile. Compute. Scroll over on our data here, the 30th percentile is 1.05. So go down here and basically we can't get exactly, but 1.05 is the 30th percentile right in here. So that's how you can find both ways.